Hello everyone and welcome to another installment of the Coin Dictionary. I'm Wu Hu and today I've got for you this 100 Colones coin from Costa Rica from 2017. We'll go over the history, the value, the basics, and any other pertinent information about this coin. So let's get started. On the obverse we see the uh, coat of arms of Costa Rica showing seven stars for the seven provinces, three volcanoes for the three mountain ranges, two ships symbolizing uh, the location between the Atlantic and Pacific Ocean, and a sunrise on the left. Uh, we see America Central, República de Costa Rica on each of these uh, ribbons there, Central America, Republic of Costa Rica, and we also see the same thing on the outer edge in much larger print. And the year of mintage, of course, down below, 2017. Turn this over to the other side. We see 100 colones, the denomination within uh, some coffee branches. And we also see the denomination in Braille right there. And this down here, BCCR, stands for Banco Central de Costa Rica, the Central Bank of Costa Rica, like I mentioned before. Uh, these coins have produced in one have been produced in one form or another since 1995. There have been varying designs to the coat of arms here, uh, as well as the overall uh, shape of the 100 over there. Uh, but what we do know is that they've been produced at the Casa de Moneda de Chile in Santiago, as well as the San Jose Mint of Costa Rica in 2010 anyway. Uh, we're not entirely sure. Actually, we do know uh, 2017 has a mintage of 40 million for circulation, uh, and it differs because uh, this accent mark above the U in República was not there in previous years. So another way to distinguish uh, just another design change from year to year on this coin. Now, 100 colones has a face value of about 19 U.S. cents. That, of course, will fluctuate with the exchange rate on any given day. Uh, on the secondary market, however, you might find a, a bit of a different story uh, as far as uh, buying this coin is concerned. In average circulated condition, uh, this coin, well, pretty much regardless of what year it is, goes for about a dollar, a dollar and change, uh, maybe two dollars and change at the absolute most. Um, that, of course, uh, depends on the seller, and that, of course, is before any shipping costs are taken into account. Anyway, hope that cleared up some information about this coin, and I'll see you next time when I've got another coin to talk about. I'll see you soon. Thanks for watching the video. My name's Christian, and I own The Coin Dictionary, and I'd also encourage you to visit us at our website, thecoindictionary.com, and on Instagram at thecoindictionary, and I'd also like to draw your attention to some other helpful coin resources, such as my other YouTube channel, Treasure Town, which does more in-depth videos about coins and collectibles, as well as some resources like coinmeltprice.com, which shows up-to-date precious metals pricing, as well as the melt values of the coins that you own, coinsmetalscards.com, which will both be a marketplace and a new source for coins, metals, and cards, as the name suggests, as well as whatsthegrade.com, which will develop into a stickering service for already graded collectibles. Have a great day, and I hope to see you on some of our other videos.